Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I want to share a really, really quick video with you on how I clean my beauty blender. Now, this is one of those things that you have to do pretty much daily and you don't want to spend a lot of time doing it. So I have found the quickest and most effective way to get the job done. So if you want to know how I do it, keep watching. All right, the first thing we're gonna do is turn on the hot water. I found that working with warmer water produces much better results than working with cold water. So continue to feel the stream of water until it feels hot. Once the water is warm enough, you're gonna run the beauty blender under the stream and soak it. Squeeze it a couple times so it absorbs the water and then continue to wring it out. Once the beauty blender is damp, you are going to take a cleansing oil. Now you can pretty much use any cleansing oil. This simple oil is the one that I have on hand right now and I'm just going to pour some drops all over the beauty blender on top of the areas that are covered in makeup. Once the oil is applied, I'm going to quickly run it under the stream of water one more time and then begin to massage the sponge you will see the foundation and creamy products pour out of this thing. It's kind of disgusting, but it's kind of satisfying at the same time. When the sponge begins to feel a little dry, you can run it under the water again to kind of reactivate it. And if you feel like you need to add a little more cleansing oil, go ahead and do that as well. So the way that I kind of stumbled upon this brilliant idea is I bought a cleansing oil for my face that I really, really didn't like. It kind of burned my eyes and there was no way I was gonna use it again. So I didn't wanna throw out a brand new product. And one day when I was washing my beauty blender, I decided to try the oil and it worked wonderfully. It worked so, so well. And now I just cannot clean my beauty blender using anything else. So once you have gotten pretty much all of the makeup out, you're gonna run it under the water again, wring it out a few times, and then I like to place it in a washcloth or a towel and just squeeze it to get the rest of the moisture out. Aside from the big chunks missing out of my beauty blender, it is pretty much like new. I tend to like nick it with my fingernails and take chunks out of it. I really need to get a new one. People say you should replace your beauty blender every month or so, but I've had mine for almost a year and it works just as well as the day I got it. I'll probably replace it at some point, but for now it works just fine. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment below letting me know how you clean your beauty blender and what products you use. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so yet. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.